Panama City continuing its mission to turn into the premier city of the Panhandle. Many rebuilding projects are on the horizon, including one at the downtown kayak launch. Tonight, News 13's Taylor Rambo tells us what we can expect in that area in the near future. The downtown kayak launch in Panama City is getting much needed renovations. It's for the most part just been, I don't want to use the word neglected, but there's really nothing there other than sand. Currently, a tractor is leveling out the land in preparation for putting in an irrigation system and bringing in new sod. The city also has plans to add a few bench swings. So often people walk the beach and, and sit in their cars just watch the sunset at that location. So we'll throw a couple of swings up. Um, it'll be a nice place just for folks to come watch the sunset. But the city is not just stopping here. Officials have plans to improve several existing waterfront access points for the community. Some of these locations include Lake Huntington Sunset Park, Adams Park, and Asbel Beach. What I'd like to do is be able to provide two or three swings at each of these locations and create a community space where in the evening it's not just one couple, maybe it's two or three couples that are down there sitting in it. It just creates a, a better sense of community. Many parks throughout the city were severely damaged from Hurricane Michael. Ferris says although they do not have the funding to start rebuilding everything, he feels that these small improvements will go a long way. These are, I think, low-cost improvements that will have a big impact. And at the end of the day, quality of life is what we're supposed to be providing. They plan to have the downtown kayak launch area completed in the next two to three weeks. In Panama City, Taylor Rambo, News 13, Panhandle Strong.